As you study the modules, from time to time there will be a place where you can get your vocabulary log. You'll see it like this. There are two ways to get your vocabulary log. The first way is to just ask your teacher. Your teacher will give you a copy and you can fill it out with a pen or pencil. As you go through the lessons, you will add new vocabulary. Write the terms in the left column. and the context in the right column. The second way is to make a digital copy with Google. Before you start, you need to open your Gmail, like this. Click on the tab to go back to the lesson. and then click on the vocabulary log icon and you'll see this but you'll notice that you can't type anything in that's because this is the teacher's copy that's why it says here view only you need to go to the file tab here go down and click make a copy it's a good idea to change the title at this point Put your name in at the beginning of the title so that your teacher can easily identify it. Also, if you haven't done it already, this is a good time to make a folder for this pathway. Click here where it says folder. On my drive at the right, click the arrow. You might already have a folder, but if you need a new one down here, click new folder. Write in the name of the pathway that you're studying right now. For example, this one. Click the check mark, and then down here click submit, and that will save the vocabulary log in this folder. Now you'll see your name in the title. Also, you can put in your information. Write in your name. And here where it says class, you can put in whatever class you're attending right now. For the pathway, identify what you're studying. Here's an example. Also, make sure you identify which module you're on at this point. And later on, your teacher will initial here after checking. Now you're ready to use your log. Now, when you need to get it in the future, go back to your Gmail, go up in the right, in the top, and you'll see this icon here. Click on that for the Google Apps. Go down and find the one called Drive and click on that. That will open your personal drive and then you'll see the folder that you created before. Double click on that to open it and then you'll see the vocabulary log. Double click to open that and there you are. You're ready to go. Click on the tab at the top to go back to the lessons. As you study the lessons, you're going to find important vocabulary that you can record in your vocabulary log. For example, when you're watching a video. As you study, pay attention to the important vocabulary.
and when you want to record it, click the tab at the top to go back to the vocabulary log, and then you can write those terms and the context on the log. You might want to put the important terms in the context into bold. You can do that like this. Click the B. Now you can go back to the lesson by clicking the tab and continue. Remember that as you go through the, the lessons and work in your vocabulary log, that Google will save your vocabulary log automatically. And that's it.